Hi and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are looking at the Harrier running belt bum bag thing. Thank you. Hi, good afternoon and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are looking at the Harrier bum bag waist running trail pack. I bought this product with my own money from the website pre-ordered it and wait for it to arrive. I've only had it about a week, so this is a sort of first impressions, sort of first look. I've done probably half a dozen runs in it so far, so I've used it enough to warrant testing and a, a brief review. So first impressions were very good. As soon as I got it out the bag and the packaging, I noticed how light it was. I think it's listed at about 150 grams but it just felt really light and soft and flexible. The material they're using is like a kind of mesh, but it's stretchy. So it just feels really comfy and it conforms to your body. I've put um, a mixture of different kit in it from, you know, buffs, gloves, hat, not this hat obviously, but more running style hats along with some food, snacks, GoPro, tripod, all sorts. And it just fitted really well because it just conformed to your body. On the inside of the bum bag, it's got some gripper, slick and gripper rails. These are designed to stick to your clothing and to prevent bounce and movement while running. I found these worked really well on a majority of my clothing. The only time I had any slight issue was when I wore them just straight on top of a pair of 2XU leggings. Because they're a bit slippery and like shiny material, I did get a little bit of movement and a little bit of bounce. But I found if I just readjusted it to go over my clothing or tightened it up, it eliminated a lot of the problem. So generally speaking, it works really well. Design of a bum bag is, is very good as well. You've got one main pocket, which zips up with a key pocket inside that with a little clip on it, like mini plastic carabiner. So you could put, for me, stuff like phones and stuff that secure that you're not likely to use on the run in that pocket. Like I said, I managed to fit quite a lot of gear in mine. On the outside of the main pocket, there's two smaller pockets, which one's designed to hold a Frenemil water bottle, which is included, which is brilliant. And then like on the back of that, there's another little pocket. On the other side, there's also two pockets. These are just mesh pockets which are open. I find them brilliant because you can stuff food and snacks and other things inside them, but access them whilst you're running by just reaching behind you and pulling it out. There's also another pocket in front of the main one, which again is open. If I didn't fill my bum bag too much, I could get a windproof in there. If not, what I did find, they've got two loops, like toggle ties on them, where if you just roll your windproof or raincoat and lay it across the top of your bum bag, it tucks in, ties down, and you can run with that like that. Sizing wise, I went for small because that fitted a criteria on their size chart. I would say, if anything, it's got a very wide range of sizing. Like, I'm 6'2", I think, a 30 two inch 31 inch waist and there's bags of space for it to go much larger than me and bags to go much smaller so it is really versatile on the sizing as well and it's got little loops to tuck away the loose excess run of the um of the adjustment so yeah really well thought out bit of kit well designed and it's really nice to see some innovation in the bum bag trail belt running market my only update would like i'd like some better colors i don't really like black it's a bit dull and boring as you know i like a bit more color so a nice red one or orange one would would be perfect for me but i understand that black does fit majority of the market and this is their first one so if anyone's got any comments or views, do please leave a, a comment down below. I'm interested to hear what your thoughts are so I can improve these videos to help people. That's what I'm here for. 
please like, subscribe and share this video and I will be back on again soon.